Hey friends, it's time for another Playwright tip and today I want to show you how you can attach your screenshots to Playwright's test reports. What I have here is a quick Playwright test that navigates to checkthq.com. It takes a screenshot that is placed in screenshots slash home PNG, then it clicks a link in the main nav and it expects that a particular heading is visible to then take another screenshot. When I now run this test using npx playwright test, you will see that this test passes. And when I inspect all the files in this directory, we will find the two screenshots right over here in the screenshots directory. But when I now have a look at the generated HTML report, you will see that, well, we can access all the steps over here and we see that there are screenshot calls, but they are not actually included in the test report. And I think it's quite nice to have them there. So how could I do this? I'm going back to my test case now and I will access the test info object that is available in every Playwright test case. And what you now can do is you can call test info attach. You can give your attachment a name, define your attachment body. So we are passing over the screenshot result over here. And we say that we want to store a PNG in this test report. Now we can remove this screenshot call over here and we can go down and also replace this screenshot call over here. We can now remove this and say that this should be the customer's attachment. And when we now run this test case, everything is still passing. But when we now open up the HTML report, you will see that here we have the two attachments that we just created while Playwright was running through this test and executed all the instructions. And I think this is just a handy way to have everything together. You can then access all your attachments by clicking on the links and the data then is included in the Playwright report here in the data section, which means that you can probably remove all these screenshot directories or video directories that you have in your repository in Git Ignore. You could get rid of these and really have everything nicely together in your Playwright report data. It doesn't only work for screenshots though. So let me just add another attachment here. I'm adding an SVG file to this test report and say, hey, this is an SVG. And when I now run this test case again, we just added three attachments to this report. And now when we have a look at it, it is raccoonified. And I think this is just very, very nice. So with test attachments, you can put everything in a single place. And I just think it's a very handy way to keep everything together. And this was this week's Playwright tip. If you enjoyed it, you might want to check out our Playwright tips playlist here on YouTube. And I will talk to you next week when we publish the next Playwright tip.